Hello, welcome to the Just a Tips train. I am Dante. And that Want a break from the ads? What are you doing, step bro? <laughs> I'm your boy Tar. Yeah. <laughs> yes, go. And just the tips. And we're, you're listening to Just the Tips. Home of the tippiest tips. The tip of the day is. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't got one. Hmm. No tip of the day. Nothing. I have a tip of the day, I guess. What is it? Oh, you would like to hear it? Yes, sir. Well, tip of the day is do not feed your dog's chocolate. <laughs> That's the sound it'll make when it comes out the other side. <laughs> this is the sound it'll make. Ooh. Ooh. And then, and then your, your sister will be like, What are you doing, Steph? No. What? No. Oh, <laughs> no. Uh, uh, nah. The whole house smell of, like dog shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sister, come to the bathroom. What are you doing, step, bro? All right, all right. These scenarios are playing perfectly in my head, man. Mm-hmm. Oh man, if I could paint a picture, man, mm-hmm. I would paint this perfectly. It'd be freaking hilarious. Mm-hmm. It's just you on the toilet. And then just shitting it on the opposite side of the door. Y'all just shitting. This is a whole family full of shit. All oh, because you gave her toilet or you gave her chocolate. You gave her toilet. <laughs> you gave her toilet. You gave her uh, chocolate, but the chocolate was laced with laxatives. So then she's shitting. You, you ain't give her a big piece. You gave her a small piece. So she's shitting, and you ain't know it was laced with laxatives. So then you shitting. You ate the whole bar. Now y'all just shitting. I was full of shit. <laughs> oh, man. It's a good picture, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> good picture. All right, let's do some reading. After this ad break. Okay. Want a break from the ads? If you tap now to watch a short video, you'll receive 30 minutes of ad-free music. All right. Thank you. Welcome back. Um, you know, we got to get that money now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you have to help us fight for great justice. Two. Two. I, I saw. I saw everything. Ooh. Well, well, we might get some useful information out of them yet. What did you see? What you saw, man? What you saw? Cody, I need to ask you something very important. What did you see on the day of the incident? Hmm. I got here that day around 2. Around 2 p.m. Okay. The music's got all intense now. I had to come in through the woods. I'm back so that old lady wouldn't see me. I got kind of lost though. I was in there for a half hour maybe half hour or so and I finally got to the studio so it's 2 30 after that what is it Cody the steel samurai killed the mad guy Uh aha he used the steel he used the samurai spear just like always one shot one count Ooh. it happened so fast I got scared 
I went home after that. Hmm. I I see. It must have been hard for you. Man, you say those nice things, but it's so obvious you aren't speaking from the heart. Wow. Um, right. Mia? Yes? I think we can say for sure this means that the Seal Samurai did it. True enough. And the director has an alibi, so it wasn't him. Indeed. So the only person left, it could have been who? What? So the only person left who it could have been is Will Powers. Wow. Hmm. I have to admit, it's kind of a shock. But if you put this boy on the witness stand, your client will be guilty for sure. Let's not call him then. I think that would be wise. Uh, best to leave this one alone. Oh. Uh, oh, is this Salmonella, maybe? Hold on. Throat's getting dry. Or the breaks from the ads? Yeah. Not so fast, pal. Oh, no, it's so detective. I heard dumps. everything. This boy here is a key witness. And he's under police protection. Start now! Dang it. Come on, son. You got a rendezvous with me at the precinct. No, I ain't going. Ah! Uh, that didn't go so well. We're back to zero leads. And now we have a serious handicap in our court. What? What are we going to do now, Omiya? Well, um, I... Uh, I really need to be going. What? Don't worry, Phoenix. I'm sure you'll be fine. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. You just left us even at a worse state than when you came last time. Come to the trial tomorrow. Please, I need you there. Phoenix, can I ask you something? Do you really believe that Mr. Powers is innocent? Oh, do we believe him? Yes, yes. That's why we took this. Of course he is. Hmm. That's all I wanted to hear. Excellent. I'll see you in court then. Wait, I wonder what would have right. happened if we said, I don't know. Interest. Thanks, Mia. See you soon. Ooh, to be continued. Man, not the TBC. Come on, man. We got some more time to, in this episode anyway. We don't have nothing. Uh, lead wise, we don't have no leads. Literally, everything that we got has turned up dry. People not giving us information, or people not give people are giving us the information, and it's not the information we need at all. No, in court, at least, it's crazy. It's the information that'll give us a handicap instead of giving us an advantage. Is what I meant to say. And now it looks like we're in the courtroom. Things are about to go down. It's looking bad. Never mind. Oh, it's Macho Man. Oh, yeah. Macho Man, man. It's heavy. Yeah. Let's go, man. Come here. Yeah. Um, uh, Mr. Wright. Yes. Why do you look so uh, unhappy? Oh, oh. Oh, nothing. <laughs> really, it's nothing. Right, Mia. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. She looks even unhappier. Yes, she does. Phoenix, we gotta tell him straight. Your client is now practically a dead man walking. Perhaps that's why I feel particularly close to him. This is no time for dead people jokes, Mia. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize it was a joke. <laughs> Good one. You know we're going into this trial utterly defenseless. Yet, if Mr. Powers is truly innocent, we should be able to find something overlooked in the evidence to prove it. Something overlooked? We have to find something, Phoenix, today. It's that or lose the trial. Everything rides on this. This isn't going to be easy. I never asked for it to be easy. 
12 minutes and 10 a.m. Did you record coming on four? Oh, it's a root time. Let's go. Holding on session for the trial of Mr. Will Pabaza. The prosecution is ready, Your Honor. The defense is ready, Your Honor. Very well. Mr. Edgeworth, your opening statement, please. An unexpected fact has come to the attention of the court. Yesterday, we learned that there were other people present at the studios. Mm. Today, I would like to show evidence proving they had nothing to do with the murder. Bravo. You may call your first witness, uh, Mr. Rogers. Uh, I wonder if it'll be the producer. The prosecution calls Mr. Sal Manella to the stand. Oh, snap. It's time to get Manella. Lisa Manelli. Or that, or that director. Oh. Will the witness oh. state his name oh, and profession? Yeah. Oh. How rude can you get? Uh, you don't even know me. Uh, uh, I'm the director. I make still samurai noob. R O F O L. So, Salmonella, I'm the director of the show on television. Or, no, he's more like. Oh, yeah, like that. All right. All right. But you at Rebel Studios on the day of the murder. Uh, yeah, so your honor. Uh, uh. Hmm. Very well. Please testify to the court about the events of that day. Phoenix, let's start by picking this testimony apart. If Powers is innocent, you know what that means. Someone in the trailer on that day did it. Da -da -da! Right. She doesn't waste any time putting on the pressure. Oh, yeah. Oh. I'm a little sweating. Oh, yeah. They had a studio light's pretty bright right now. I was in the studio. We're in the courtroom. Uh, hey. But this is a play. <laughs> I was <laughs> I was at the studios from around nine o'clock in the morning. During the twenty uh, morning, I was doing um, uh, an action scene to run through. Uh, it took a little more time than it would. Uh, I thought it would, you know. Uh, I hear that everyone else laid a lunch and we all uh, employee area. You know, uh, but I had a meeting in a studio to trailer, so I ended up skipping lunch. We were in a meeting until around uh, four o'clock. During the meeting, well, I'm pretty sure no one left the chairs. How can you be sure? Huh. That's about it. Huh. Hmm. The time. Mr. Hammer's death was 2.30 p.m. And according to your testimony, you were in a meeting at that time. Mm. Mr. Wright, you may begin your cross-examination. Okay. Yes, Your Honor. Cross-examination. Then, then, then. You already know we have to press first. Press first. Is that when you were always? Is that when you always come into work? God, man, I am getting oh. worse and worse with bleeding. Oh no, I come in all sort of hours. It's the industry way. Well. Yeah, yeah, I know all about the freaks in your industry. Hmm. Still. F Y, he's like, still F W I W. I was pretty busy all that day. I don't know what that means. Tell us more about this. We gonna press you. 
We go on. Press here. In the employee area? Oh, that's right. It was a fight scene between a steel samurai and an evil magistrate. <laughs> was anyone else at the run through? Oh, oh yeah. I think Karen like, was sitting there watching the whole time thing. The whole thing. L O L. She was tearing on Hammer, if you can believe it. She certainly has the lungs for it. Anyone else? Nope. Um, just us four. <sighs> Took a lot more time than I thought it would. Why did it go on so long? Oh, I'm pretty sure you already heard about this. But W.O. Pale twisted his ankle during a run through scene. Oh, oh right. Thus the limp. The limp. My bad. Yeah, yeah. Which, of course, led to me missing my lunch. R F D O F F S L. Blah, 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 blah. Whatever that means. Rolling on the floor? Starving? Ah! Ah, ah. Let's press one more time before we get on out of here. What exactly did they have for lunch? Oh, I think I'm fake. from up. Come to think of, come to think of it, there was a plate with some bones on it in the employee area. Everyone else, meaning that the witness did not eat with them. Meaning that we are gonna come back next time and we're gonna figure it out. Ooh. 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 And until that time, just the tips. It's just a tip and on out of here, baby. Let's 